Audience of Radio Big Sky, welcome. Today we have a special show. It's not the Pivot Show. It's not tuned up at Big Sky, but we are honored to have two uh, of our high school students, Carly and John, with us today. They are both part of the um, National Honor Society here in Big Sky. So welcome, you two. Appreciate Thank you being you. here, taking time out. You'll notice Carly has got her superhero uh, goggles on, mask on, not her COVID mask, but her superhero mask. Uh, and John and I both have our capes. John actually has his on, and I have my my cape. And we'll find out what that H really represents here in just a minute as we get going. But we got a really cool event that we want to talk about that's happening on May 17th. Carly, why don't we get started with who can be involved in this event? Actually, you know what? Let's start with why why we do this event. Um, and and and, and who, it, who it's in memory of. And if you want me to get started, or one of you guys want to take it away, go for it. Um, okay, so we, this is uh, LPHS National Honor Society, sixth annual um, Harbor's Hero Run, and it's in memory of Harvard D. Ward. Okay. And um, we do this every year as a way to um, encourage, run in honor of Harbor and keep his memory alive. Cool. And um, a little and background. Really Let me just interrupt you for a second, Carly. A little background about who Harbor was. He was one of our, our students here in our school district that um, passed away uh, several years ago. And um, the community has, has, has gathered around um, him leaving us and, and creating different events, scholarships, and uh, various things to not only remember him but to honor his spirit and and for instance this h right here is um for harbor and you know something there's a ski run for those of you who aren't in big sky but there's a ski run we named after him um there's this race that we're going to talk about in a moment um several of the uh camps around big sky up and around big sky uh, have a especially camp moonlight has a special award where we honor him and we give our recipients to our scholarships. Um, this one of these capes each year. This is my son's. He he earned it in 20, 2018. Um, and and the reason we it's superheroes is because that was one of Harbor's passions or um, jams as we call it is, you know, wearing capes and running around dressed up like a superhero. So Carly, go back into who 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 can help us with this run or what this run is all about. So this run is really um, for the entire community, or in fact, this year, since um, it's more online and individual, anybody really can participate. Yeah, we'd love but, to reach all the corners of this earth if we can get people out there doing this. Um, that would be amazing. Yeah, we're just encouraging everyone to stay active and run this 5K Harbor's Hero Run. Um, and it was scheduled this year for may 17th but that is not going to happen as of the current conditions but we have a website where people can still register and we also have different routes okay. where people can run so john yeah I heard. Um, tell us a little bit about these these routes uh that people can run where we can find them um so like carly was saying um and what Mr. Harder has mentioned. Um, so the race is, is, was supposed to be, the race was supposed to be scheduled on, um, on May 17th. However, due to um, the current pandemic, we cannot proceed with that and we cannot congregate. So we're doing it so, socially distanced. So you guys can go out and run either on May 17th in your superhero gear whether it's something as fashionable and prestigious as what mr harder has or something a little bit down and then all the way down is kind of what i have just whatever works just be in theme um and then so you can either go out may 17th or just throughout the spring and then we at national honor society we implore you guys to please take photos of the event um there's a hashtag uh so you you can follow the event on instagram at harbors underscore hero underscore run and then the hashtag is Harbors, Harbors Hero Run. So that's no space. Okay, so no on space. Instagram, at Harbors 
uh, underscore hero underscore run uh, or hashtag Harvard's hero run. And then Mr. Harder, if you want to scroll down and go to that poster. Yep. There's, there's an awesome picture of Harbor poster. Oops. Uh, here are some of the suggested routes, I believe. If you are going to do this, and we, we really encourage you to do this, if you do not live in Big Sky, you know, please create your own 5K, 1K. If you have little kids, little monsters that want to want to run it with you. Um, all this is found uh, if you go to the BSSD, that's Boy Susie Susie David 72 uh, website, um, you'll find a page that has all of this on there. Uh, and here's a poster that's been created, um, which gives us more details. Here's the hashtag and, and where to follow the Harbors Hero Run. Um, and here's the website you can see. Um, so we encourage you to go to bssd72.org to get more information. It's all clearly laid out in this uh, website. Um, Carly, tell us a little bit about registration. What, what do people have to do to register this? Just scroll, scroll back down to where you're at. You just have to fill out that form right there, your name, last name, age, email address. It's a very easy, simple process. Let's see how easy it is. If I can um, disclose some of this information here. Yeah, and so as Mr. Harder mentioned, you guys just type in bssd72.org and then you scroll down a little bit and then one of the first links is for the Harbor Zero Run. So you click on that link and then the website cleanly lays out. You can um, you can see what, whatever you wanna see. You can see event pictures, past yeah. events, um, and then you can, history and past runs. You can see past posters for the events and past pictures of Harbor himself or uh, people running the race. Cool. Uh, then donations to the scholarship fund yeah. education and then picture. Uh, Carly touch on where this uh, scholarship fund uh, originates um, the scholarship fund um, we've, um, is that part of uh, Lone Peak High yeah well the scholarship fund too I know a lot of it goes through WIA women in action and okay. they contribute a lot okay um, and it's also uh, and gives money to kids in um, summer camps and okay. different things like that, cool. just like Camp Moonlight. Okay. Um, cool. So it looks like uh, race registration is a twenty dollar fee. Um, are you still doing t-shirt and 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 things like that, or or this year is it uh, primarily based on what 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 you can offer? Is it still set at twenty dollars, or could you add more, or, or take away less, or? Um. Yeah. You, or, I'm pretty sure that you can donate. Um. Just any amount to, of donation. We don't have a T-shirt this year, right? so. Um. So, so basically, it's really anything. Yeah. The donation is goes towards um, scholarship funds. Um summer camps uh, possibly. And um, is, is there a scholarship set up at LPHS that is specifically called the Harbor Scholarship? Is that, has, has that been ever set up? I don't think so. Okay. I'm not really sure. Cool. Well, people can find out more here. Um, please, we encourage you to go there. Um, so we've got May 17th or any day this spring that you want to. It'd be really cool if we could get, you know, everybody doing their, their run, socially distancing on May 17th. Um, it's, in, it's in our calendar. Uh, my family's going to participate. And uh, what else did we miss? Um, um, yeah. I'd just like to say maybe a quick shout out to our Genesis event sp sponsors. So, okay. um, J.P. Woolies, Hungry Moose Market and Deli, Big Sky Vacation Rentals, Big Sky Fitness Fusion and Pilates, Lone Peak Physical Therapy, Gallatin Alpine Sports, Roxy's, Big Sky Build, Ozage, um, and then the resort. We thank you guys so much for sponsoring this event. Also, yeah. hopefully next year we'll all be running together um, yeah. this time mm -hmm. of year. Cool. So everyone check out uh, all the places. Instagram, um, I'll, if you're following Radio Big Sky, I'll also have those uh, places on Instagram and those hashtags that you can um, support.
get out there, uh, train for it, take pictures, run it, get dressed up in uh, awesome costumes of superhero-ness, whoever your superhero might be. Uh, John, who's your superhero? My superhero? Yep. Like my favorite superhero? You got it. You know, that, that's a tough one, but um, I think I'm going to have to go with Superman. Okay, Carly? The Flash. Ooh, I used to love pretending I was the Flash, obviously. And then um, um, if you guys have pictures and you want it to be posted on the website, you can email Michael Romney at bssd72.org. So that's Michael, M-I-C-H-A-E-L-R-O-M-N-E-Y at bssd72.org, like Mr. Harder mentioned. So that's also on the website. Information is on the website. Cool. All right. Uh, Carly, any last words? No. Okay. Get out there. Thank you, uh, listeners, uh, fans, no fans, whatever you may be. Um, keep a lookout. We hope to see uh, everybody out running, whether you're in Big Sky or you're in New Jersey or you're in, um, you know, uh, Singapore. Please get out there. Run for Harbor. Let's raise some funds uh, for local kids. And in the spirit of Harbor, get out there and get crazy. And um, we hope to see everyone out there running. Thanks for joining. You too. Thanks for taking time out of your school day. We for sure. We thank you, Mr. Thank Harder, you. for um, putting this on and helping us get the word out. Right on.